How's it going, man? You're nominated for Song of the Year. Yeah, I'm, uh, it's going great, man. I'm very excited to be here. Yeah. What, what does that mean to be nominated in a songwriting category? Um, it's a huge honor. It's a huge, huge honor. Um, for me, like, I, I, I think I, I do this to make music, and to that's 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 that was always <clears throat> the big the big drive was just to make new music, and that's always what I want to do. So to be recognized for that, and that, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. It's been an unbelievable six months for you. I mean, the song is in the top five of the Hot 100. You performed on SNL. You're at the Grammys. You're performing with Annie Lennox. What What is like the one thing that is the most un, was the most unforgettable thing for you? Like, what do you have one moment that you just could not forget? Um, all of them. I gotta say, SNL was a bit was a big deal for me. That's I mean, that's a dream for any musician to be nominated for a Grammy. I I, I think to be performing at the Grammys is probably. I haven't done it yet, but even even, and you know, that is probably one. Of, this will be one of the biggest things of my career to, to date. You know what I mean? A any nerves? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'd be lying if. I mean, I feel okay now, but you know, a few feet from the stage, I'll be I'll be rattled. I'll be shaken. Yeah. Whatever. Who like who who do you hope to sit like? I I imagine you looking out in the front row and seeing like Beyonce and like Kanye West and being and like, oh my goodness, I'm performing in front of these guys. In the in yeah, it's terrifying. When when you're doing like the rehearsals and the sound check, they have all the name all the name places there. Prince is 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 sitting there in the front row. Well, certainly a placard that says Prince, and that like the fact that I'm standing there pretending like I'm a I'm a guitarist of any of any kind of you know, of any note, that that that's terrifying. Yeah, so I'm I'm looking forward to that. Yeah. I mean, take me to church. Still going strong. Top five of the Hot 100. Can you talk about your next single? Like, I, I mean, it's so hard to follow up a smash hit like this. What is the uh, the next song that's going to go to radio? Um, we are looking at maybe uh, a, a work song, and uh, I think we'll we'll wait and see. But I think I think we'll we'll be working towards work song, and see 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 how that goes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 absolutely, yeah. So, how did you spend your Grammys morning? Um, sound check and and, and, and dress rehearsal and, and trying not to think about the fact that it's Grammys morning. I think. Yeah. Uh, last question: We're asking everybody, what did you listen to on the ride over? Uh, I've been listening a lot to uh, Haim the last few days, and um, I'm a huge Haim fan. And I, I got to meet them there a few days ago. They played the Grammy Museum. So, in the mornings, just to kind of get me pumped. I think it's a spectacular album. I think it's an amazing piece of I mean, they could win Best New Artist, you could win Song of the Year, and high five, and there you go. Dream. Right there. <laughs> Dream. So. Well, man, thank you so much, Hosier. I really appreciate it, and, and best of luck, man. Rooting for you.